breaking news here on Impact Wrestling. Eli Drake has a case for a tag team championship match, and he's got a partner, it appears. Yeah, cut the music. Oh, no. He's got a microphone. Sit down and shut up. Oh, here we go. <laughs> hey, K-Dog. Looks like you just saw a ghost. Because you know who I am and what I'm about. But let me explain to these white trash, these rednecks out here, that I am one half of the greatest tag team in the history of the business. Yep. The Steiner brothers, you can't deny and that. And then I was the most dominant world champion in the NWO. You white trash don't believe me? You millennials out there watching that TV right now don't believe me? Go on your cell phone, YouTube. I'm world famous, bitch. Oh my God. Scott Steiner just yeah. said millennials. <laughs> what? Eli Drake knows that. That's why he calls me. Because at this point in my career, seems like when somebody wants to get somebody else's ass kicked, they call me. So mark this date down, April 22nd. Three things are gonna happen. You're gonna lose your title. You're gonna get your ass kicked. And you're gonna realize that I'm the man with the shortest fuse and largest arms in professional wrestling. I'm not sure what language that was. That's a lot of linguistic menstruation to decipher. But I will tell you this. You don't disrespect the Latino nation. And another thing, baby nuts, you too are the master. Your modest operandi, great word for a Latino, is mind games and trash talk. So let the mind games begin. Eli, did it ever occur to you that Scott Steiner may not show up, might show up late, or might kick your ass before the match starts? Did that ever occur to you? Let that seep in. Let the mind games continue. Scotty, I want to know, do you still have it? Are you here for a payday? Are you here just to generate a buzz? Because these people have a lot of chance. On April 22nd, they might be chanting L-A-X. L -A -X. Wow. This is getting intense. Or they might be chanting, you still got it. But I'm going to keep it 100. I don't think you got the hunger, the anger, or the passion that LAX has. As a matter of fact, I don't think you still got it because you look like you couldn't tear up a chicken out of luau. <laughs> what the? You know what, old man Conan? Oh. What, Brody from Homeland? <laughs> you know what I call you? I call you a wedge, which is basically a useless tool. So, when I think about it, you're looking at here at a guy who's part of what he would call the greatest tag team on the earth, the Steiner Brothers. Shut up, dummies, any time for you to cheer. But right now, what you're looking at is now the new, current greatest tag team of all time, the Big Bad Gravy Daddy, the Big <laughs> Bad Booty Daddy, and we are coming to take those tag team titles, and there ain't a thing you can do about it, and that's not an insult, that is just a fact of life. <laughs> the, big, the, big, the Big Bad Gravy Daddy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, 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 cut off the music. What I am looking at is that a current has been and a future has been, and let me tell you another thing. The current champions dictate the music cues, not the ex-champions. LAX, hasta la muerte y después. The stage is set for an incredible tag team matchup. LAX defend their world tag team titles. Live on pay-per-view against Eli Drake and Scott Steiner.